subscribe. Welcome to my channel. My name is Erin and I am a hypnotherapist, RTT practitioner, business major, and I'm 38 years old and I have lots of life experience. So I have learned lots of things and done a lot of things. I've had a lot of things happen because it's life. So, yeah. So today, I want to talk to you about who is the most difficult to hypnotize. Let me tell you, there's only like really one person that's most difficult to hypnotize and that is the person that you cannot communicate with. If you cannot communicate with someone, then it will be pretty difficult to hypnotize them. That is the only person that is not hypnotizable. Everybody, 100% of people are hypnotizable. I say this because have you ever been on your phone scrolling your newsfeed and like two hours just went by and you were like looking at someone else's friend of a friend's pictures and you don't even know that person and you're like, what the heck was I doing? Yeah, no, that's form of hypnosis. So you can be hypnotized. Anybody can. It's just a matter of what kind of person each person is because that determines the approach you use for each specific person. What makes hypnosis difficult though for some people is people with analytical minds. People with analytical minds that are trying to figure things out the whole time. They are, you know, sitting there thinking about the process and everything. Those people, they have a, more of a difficult time getting into that trance state. Someone that has a difficult time visualizing pictures in their mind, they're going to have a little bit more of a difficult time going into hypnosis because they're going to have a harder time seeing the images because in hypnosis we use very descriptive, vivid wording and it's like a very visual inner, inward visual experience. People that have fear of losing control mindset, the ones that have difficulty visualizing things inside their head, a good way to help fix that is to get into the habit of telling your mind what you want it to do. So, i.e. going online and finding self-hypnosis audios so you can practice, practice, practice. So you can get into the groove of, and your mind will eventually start to figure out what you're trying to get it to do and it will do it easily. So have no fear tribe. Transformation, lasting permanent results are available to everyone. So some people just got to work on it a little harder than a little harder than others. That's just like every other thing, you know? Some people take to some things more easily. Some don't. You know? Like riding a bike. It's no biggie. But I tell you right now, hypnosis gets more powerful the more you do it. So anyways, that's all I have for today. Love and light to you all.